Want to learn how to rule a Dutch? I got that for y'all. Coming up. We are Strains of the Bay, and if you're new here, we review strains around the Bay Area as well as other cannabis and non-cannabis related content. If that sounds like something you'd be interested in, which I'm sure it does, consider subscribing and hitting that bell button to be notified every time I release a video. The goal for this one is 15 likes, just like the last one, which I think is very possible, so go ahead and do that right now, or whenever you feel like it. And hey, at any point during the video, check out the links and show notes down in the description. All the stuff you see on here will be down there as well as the equipment I used to film my videos and anything else I forgot to mention. Alright, uh, let's get a little bit closer so I can show you exactly how to do it from a good point of view. Alright, come closer, come, come here. There you go. Fucking goddamn it. There you go. I'm having hell trouble. <laughs> you want to open it up? There you go. Give it a quick smell. Hmm. Nothing too fancy. No berries. This is just straight honey fusion. So tobacco and honey. Yeah, not too bad. So pull one of these guys out. Fucking. Sh Here you go. That's one right there. Next, you're gonna. There's actually two layers on this. So if you can see, kind of ripped here, there's a layer beneath the uh, natural leaf, and that's this lighter brown here. So what we're gonna want to do is actually take this natural leaf off. You'll find the end seam, as you can see, it's kind of right here, and just roll it up out of there. Be careful. See, this one tends to stick a bit. <laughs> so the whole, so maybe we'll start again. Let's see. Alright guys, so the next thing we're going to do is actually split the blunt. And you don't need a knife, razor, or none of that for this part. All you got to do is split from the top and work your way down. So, um, you should start at the mouthpiece in my opinion. It's very, uh, if you can tell both sides. This side tends to be a bit bigger and looser and the mouthpiece is tighter. And in my opinion, it's easy to really crack a spot at the top if it's tighter. So, you will crack it right here. Right here. <laughs> Work it down. There you go. I've never had you know the split seam deviate to the side. It's always been straight down. So don't worry about it. Y'all will get it. Don't don't worry about it. There you go. You're just gonna spill this shit out, so let me toss this away. After you dump it, it should look just like this. All right, so the next thing you're gonna wanna do is to actually put your bud in the blunt. So I'll lay it out like that. And just sprinkle it on this bitch. It's alright if it spills out, as you guys see I have my little uh, tray here. So if you don't have this piece of paper or anything of that nature, would work. And okay, spread it out evenly. Even as you can. Okay. Quick tip, if you are a right-hander, which I am, you'd want to start on the left side and work your way down to the right. And if you're left-handed, opposite sides start from the right, going left. So see, right here, you're going to want to practice tucking and rolling it in as you can see right there yep. tucking and rolling it in tucking and rolling it in let me lick that part right here you can lick this close so we're just gonna work our way down again and tuck and roll. See, it's kind of fat. We'll take some of this shit. <laughs> tuck and roll. And we just tuck and roll all the way down. There you go. So now I'm just going to lick this whole part clean. And tuck and roll. 
<laughs> Down. So let me clean this up a bit. All right, y'all. Just fixed it up a little bit, and now finished product is right here. We are all done. It's kind of misshapen a little bit. It's not the perfect looking one, but trust me, it's gonna hit. <laughs> Absolutely. So if you can see, but on that side, oop, kind of blurry. And on that side as well. And we're done. All right, guys. So now that we're all done, y'all should have the perfect touch. All right. Thank you guys very much for watching. And uh, I'm actually not going to smoke this right now. Right now, it's going to be in the next couple of videos. So if you would like to see me smoke this, go ahead and subscribe and hit that bell button down below to be, not uh, to be notified when that video comes out. All right. So remember, kids, don't do drugs. Give them all to me. Hey guys, real quick, if you want to get some new glass and smoking accessories as well as help support me and the channel, check out the links to or check out my links to Dent Geek below. Uh, I'm affiliated with them and use their items. They got the Grav Labs glass blunt for $11.99, Sherlock pipe for $22.95, which is the one they actually sent me in a video, uh, which I'll link somewhere around here. And it's one that I use every day, no complaints there. The glass is thick, high quality, and gives me great, great hits. They also have more expensive shit like this Empire Glassworks Dragon Ball Pipe for $73.50 or bongs like this Gra uh, Grav Labs Round Base Water Pipe with a geometric ice pinch for $109.99. Um, all that actually comes with free shipping so it doesn't matter if you buy something for 5 bucks, 10 20 it's all free shipping. And it's all discreet shipping as well so if you're worried about that kind of thing, you don't need to. Uh, as you know, we VTubers aren't really getting any ad revenue. So any purchase helps me out immensely. Thank you guys in advance. And if you can't buy anything, it's all good. Just leave a like if you learned anything or were entertained in any way. Alright, thank you guys. Peace out, trainees. Later.